Recently I was in Wales and whenever I go home to visit uh, my parents and my family in my hometown I always go down to Nick's gym. It's the local facility there and the guy's great. They open the, the gym up for whenever I want because sometimes I like to train very early in the morning before they open or on a weekend for instance and uh, I always uh, ask them to put me through a workout. They've got some great trainers there. Martin is the boxing trainer there and he's a boxer himself and uh, he uh, was putting me through uh, some boxing sessions when I was there recently. I've got a background in Muay Thai and kickboxing however I haven't done a lot of it in recent years and I like to change up my training styles. I like to stay versatile uh, and not only just train the lower body with running, cycling or you know uh, on a Stairmaster, I like to hit the upper body as well to keep my spine loose and agile and also stay uh, activated within the brain because if you're on a Stairmaster, a treadmill or lepticle or anything like that, it's very easy to kind of just lose yourself even if you are listening to a book or a podcast or any of the sort. However, you have to be completely present and I find this is a great exercise for the mind. Uh, very similar to if you're playing tennis or if you're doing a combat sport or if you're doing um, you know sometimes like a crossfit session you have to be very present and you have to really utilize your neuromuscular pathways so you have that brain to muscle skills that can be quite exhausting in itself and i think it's very important not only to exercise your physicality but your mentality as well so i like to combine the both and you know I, I know i'm not the best boxer i'm not the fastest i'm not the strongest i'm not the most powerful however i like to continue to learn and improve that process and you know doing some boxing or kickboxing but in this case uh, you know some pad work did some rope work uh, did several rounds and did some functional work as well i think it's absolutely awesome not only is it good for the brain good for the body good for versatility uh, agility it's it really allows the the session to go over very very quick so if you're one that feels that cardio sessions take a little bit too long then try something like a boxing class or if you've got a trainer a boxing trainer do some sessions with him because i tell you what even though that hour is absolutely horrible you will feel like throwing up you will get lightheaded the lactic acid burn is going to be unbelievable to the extent that you can almost smell that acid burning through your flesh that hour goes exceptionally quick because you're being pushed the entire time and doing something like this does take you out of your comfort zones and I believe sometimes that we have to be very uh, comfortable being uncomfortable in order for us to evolve and if you're putting yourself into a situation that you are not familiar with your body will adapt your body will evolve by taking itself out of that comfort zone and in you know basically enjoying that stress and by uh, protesting that stress to a certain extent it has to grow faster it has to grow stronger it has to be more agile or you'll never be able to attest your skills to the next session